Hey everyone, Garbage here. Yeah, when's the last time you played a game with a text-based user interface? It's probably been a while, right? Yeah, recently I've been enjoying me some Fallout New Vegas and opening my inventory and seeing my items listed in text form instead of as icons and pictures really brought me back to the days of old computer terminals and CRT monitors, which I think fit really well with the setting of Fallout. It's just we don't see it very much these days. As someone who loves using the command line on my computer as much as possible, text interfaces make me happy. Uh, but I think from a gameplay perspective, they're kind of hit or miss for a few reasons, and I want to talk about those in this video. Yeah, probably the biggest issue, at least for me, is the speed in which text can deliver information to the player. You know, visual picture-based interfaces deliver information almost instantly. All right, if you see a picture of a healing potion in your inventory, you know you have a healing potion right away. Text, however, is a little more involved, right? I'm no neuroscientist, but what I understand is that reading is a complex process and it requires multiple parts of your brain working together to process letters and sounds and combine them into words that have meaning. And this process is usually somewhat slower than getting information from a picture. You know, that little extra time savings really begins to add up when you're dealing with like hundreds of items in your inventory. Picture-based interfaces also tend to be more accessible. You know, pictures are universal. Almost anyone who isn't blind can get some value out of them. Whereas with text, you know, you're kind of screwed. If you have dyslexia or if the game doesn't have a translation for your particular language, text unfortunately excludes people. It limits the number of people who can experience the game it was meant to be experienced. Now, one downside of pictures is that they can sometimes be a little ambiguous. You know, there have been plenty of instances where I've mistaken one item for another because their icons look too similar. Or instances where I wasn't sure what an icon meant because it was too abstract. Now, all of this can be avoided with good design, but not every game has good design. And who's to even say what good design even is, right? No, text is unambiguous, right? There's no question about what information you're receiving because it literally spells it out for you, even if it does take a little bit longer to process. That's why picture-based interfaces are often supplemented with a little bit of text as well to reduce ambiguity. Now, one interesting thing about Fallout is that the first two games in the franchise, which were PC exclusive, had really beautiful picture-based interfaces with icons that you could click on and drag around and it was only with the transition to 3D and consoles that Fallout adopted a more text-based approach. I think this was done partially for artistic purposes, really leaning into that retro-futurism theme. And, but it was clearly also done to better accommodate console players who are using controllers to navigate the UI. Text interfaces tend to work pretty well with D-pads and a limited range of buttons, so that probably had something to do with it. But what do you think? Why did they make this change? Let me know down in the comments and have a nice day.